Hi, I'm Nancy Drew. Since you can tell a lot about a person by where he or she lives, I thought I'd introduce myself by showing you my room. As you can see, I keep it pretty neat. Of course, I don't spend that much time in here. I always seem to be off solving mysteries. We're here, so you'll get to prove yourself soon enough. You hear that? Order up. Order up. Order up. Order up. <coughs> Order up. Well, hello there. You must be the new maid Ollie told us about. I'm Bill Kessler. This guy's Lou Talbot. Hey. What's your name again? Nancy. Nancy Drew. Just thought I'd come over and say hello. Well, Lou here's a grad student. Art major, of all things. You're probably gonna need a jackhammer and some hydrochloric acid to clean his room, eh? Have you two been at the lodge for a while? About a week, I guess. I checked in right after he did. We sat down after breakfast one morning and discovered that this fox and geese game is pretty darn fun. I've been whipping his tail ever since. You didn't just come here to play games, did you? Heck no. I came for the ice fishing. Of course, knowing there's a renegade wolf running around is kind of dampened my enthusiasm. What about all the accidents that have been happening around here? Bad luck, that's all. No, the only thing that bothers me about this place is the wolf. They should get rid of it, and the sooner the better. They didn't put up with wolves prowling around this place 40 years ago, and they shouldn't put up with them now. Hey, I know what you can do. Shovel the snow off the skating pond so we can do some speed skating. Anything to make you guests happy. Since Mr. Talbot isn't here, could I play a game of fox and geese with you? You bet. Have a seat. Here are the rules. The white pieces are the geese. The black piece is the fox. The goal of the geese is to corner the fox so he can't move, while the goal of the fox is to gobble up geese so that they can't corner him. The geese can only move forward along a line to the next point, either directly forwards, diagonally, or sideways. Same thing for the fox, except when he's next to a goose that has an empty spot directly behind it. He can jump over it, gobble it up, right, gobble it up and remove it from the board. You just take turns and play until somebody wins and somebody loses. I'll be the fox. Ready? You bet.
<laughs> Looks like somebody has their work cut out for them when it comes to shoveling off this pond. That ought to do it. Ha! Huh, who goes there? Uh, Nancy Drew? Nancy Drew shall not pass unless and until she proves herself worthy. And how does she do that? By hitting the snow princess ten times. Snowballs only, no ice balls. What are ice balls? Snowballs made of ice. If you get hit with one, it can knock you out. So don't throw it or I'll tell my dad. You must be Ollie's daughter, Freddy. I am the snow princess. Prepare to defend yourself. <laughs> The face from a clock, it's all melted. Part of the timing device that was used to trigger the bomb that blew up the bunkhouse, maybe?